Baron Von Games has finally gone and done it. He's made a brand new game called Bot Wars, which will be releasing tomorrow on the Steam store. But what is Bot Wars and should you get it? Bot Wars is a strategy base building game where you control a squad of highly customizable bots with the objective of destroying and capturing the enemy's base in order to become the number one corporation on the planet. In this game, you can upgrade your bots, you can upgrade your defenses and you can even upgrade your squad. Now Bot Wars was made by a small up-and-coming YouTuber called Baron Von Games. <laughs> but if you want to know whether or not you should buy Bot Wars, well you'll have to watch this gameplay and my review. And make sure you don't go anywhere because at the end of this video, I'm going to be doing a giveaway for this game. Here we go. This is my squad. And as you can see on this map, we've got the purple base, we've got the red base, and we've got the green base. And yes, I've already lost a comrade. Now, if you look up at the top there, you'll see I've got a blue flame and each of the bases have their own flame. So the objective here is we've actually got to build up our tower defenses and upgrade our squads with the objective of taking out the enemy base and capturing their flame. And you only win once you've captured all four flames. But first things first, we need to get ourselves up here and build ourselves a barrack. So I'm going to press T to send my squad on here. We're going to capture this base. You're going to see straight away that is going to level us up. And if you look in the middle, I can now unlock new units. If I press 2, I can get a grenader, which I definitely want to do. But you'll also see if I press B, I can upgrade this to a different type of base. I can't currently afford that. So instead, what I'm going to do is I'm going to try and snipe out some nasty purples. Let's go. That was way more effective than I thought it was gonna be. Okay, so turns out going first person, really good idea. I swear you're more accurate in first person, mate. That is absolutely insane. Squad level up already, but now I do have enough money to upgrade this. So what I'm gonna do is I'm gonna upgrade this to an armored barracks because it is very much in the middle and in the firing line. So I want it to be able to defend itself from these nasty purple team when they begin to push over the bridge. Let's just support my boys down here real quick. Let's go. Come on. Yes, mate. This gun is insane. Let's go. Okay, I am being... In fact, I did just get slaughtered, but let's just gloss over that. Okay, but instead of running over to the purple base and trying to take their base, as you can see, they've got defenses and they are constantly spawning their units. They've got a turret there and they've got a turret there. However, if you look at the green team over here, they're looking a little bit more vulnerable because we're actually taking their base from the site. And actually, if you look down there, I've already got half a squad down there and more blues going over the side. Now, if I come into my actual base over... Oh, wait, hold on. Wait, are those all mine? I think we're slapping purple, but they've just upgraded their towers. But if I come into my actual stronghold, you will see I have more of these barracks options in here. Because this one is tucked away and pretty safe, I'm actually going to make this one a generator. And because it's extra safe, I'm going to actually double up on the generator right there. So we've got an armored barracks over there, a turret over there and then inside our base we've actually got one of these generators which makes more gold for us more gold equals more dangerous units also i just spotted we've got a couple of little goodie crates let's crack these open we can get more upgrades and more upgrades equals more damage and more damage equals more fun down we go because we've actually got another base down here now the front of my base is very well protected against the purples i kind of just want to defend against the purples but on this base here which is facing the green team, you can see we're already invading them. So I actually want this base here to be a tier 2 barracks so that I can unlock some juicy units. Now, if I press L, I'm gonna get a bigger squad size upgrade. And now you can see, if I press E, I can buy a sniper. And then if I press 2, I can buy whatever that guy is. I can also buy one of these. And then I think that's my squad size full. Sad. I want more guys. Yeah, I've got 7 of 7, you can see in the corner, but that's fine. What we're gonna do is I'm gonna get my lads and I'm gonna send them through here. We got two grenaders, we got a sniper, we got some bazooka boys, and my boys have already captured this base. I didn't even do this. They've already gone and done that again. We're just trying to push the assault against these guys. And in fact, actually what I'm gonna do is I'm gonna upgrade this to a big bot platform and you're gonna see this monster come out here. Okay, we're gonna take the pain to the green team. No surrender, no mercy. The green team is going down. The big lad is in. He's gonna come 
cause some damage. Okay, let's get up here. Let's get on this platform. We're gonna capture more bases. This time, I'm gonna go for the shotgun tower. And actually, can I upgrade it more? Yeah, we're gonna go for the heavy machine gun turret. Look at that bad boy. Let's go. But the greens are still spawning inside. Okay, so I've swapped over to a grenader right here because this guy is gonna allow me... This is such a cluster. Come on, boys. Get in here. What I'm gonna do... Oh, no. My big dude got killed. Okay, that's fine. It's not the end of the world. I just need to get round here nice and quick. Come on, blow up. Yes. Okay, so it looks like our defenses over on the other side there seem to be holding up, which is nice. So what we might do... In fact, what we're already doing, the advance on the red team. Because have we captured that flame? How have we not... Oh, they've still got something up there. I need to go back up and capture that flame. We need to completely flip that flame. Otherwise, we've not fully taken the base. There we go. The lad's gone in with his hammer. Yeah, boy, let's go. The wee man did it all on his own with a hammer. I respect the effort. Okay, we got a big old turret here. What am I gonna do with this? I think I think I'm gonna get a sniper tower. And then how much is it to upgrade the sniper tower? 200 to upgrade the sniper tower to what's that called? It's called the death beam. That sounds quite nice. I might get that. There we go. Death beam. Oh, it is a big lad. Let's see what the death beam does then. Ah, yeah, that's what the death beam... Okay, yeah, kind of a fitting name. Wow. Yeah, the death beam does quite a lot of death. Fair play. Okay, now that we've officially taken that base, we're now going in. You can see we got the blue over there. We got the blue over there. We're gonna take down red. Once we've taken down red, we're then gonna make a move on the purple team. Okay, actually looks like we might have killed the red team or at least most of them because look at that base there has been taken down. And if you look up to the top, there is currently no flame flying. Oh my god, what is that? That was a little bit terrifying. Okay, and I'm dead. Oh, the death ray is so OP, man. I love it. Okay, I've sent my lads in. Look, I've hired just a bunch of shield boys. In fact, what we're gonna do is because we've got the shield boys, I want them to be invincible. So I'm just gonna sink a bunch of my points plus 200 health on every single one of those lads. And look at that. The blue flame now flies on three separate islands. And I've got to say, one of the things that I really like about bot wars with this aesthetic is that as you capture things, you can see all the bases slowly change color. I really, really like that. Oh, chump bot deleted. Another chump bot? Yeah, that's what I thought. Let's see how effective that big lad is against me. Oh my god, I'm holding the line. This is... I okay, I am way in over my head here. I should not be going forward. I just can't deal with... Okay, there we go. About time I got killed. Oh my god, there's another big lad coming. Okay, just turn the shield, turn the shield. Can I kill it? Yes, I can. There we go. Okay. Gonna go see if I can capture this base under here. Okay, they do have something here. I was not- and it's gone. Okay, lads, this is silly. We need to make a move on the purple base. How have we not killed them yet? How are we- oh, okay. That's not- that's not what I was hoping to do right there. That's not what I was aiming for. Okay, boys, come on. Go, 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 go. Oh, I just dropped off again. <laughs> Why? My poor bots. Oh, more of them are off. Okay. Okay, let's just- are all my bots off the side of the map? What did I just do? I've just like mass murdered my bots. Okay, let's just try and move up here, hold the line, and I'm dead and another one's floating down to the bottom. What have I done? Have I killed them all? Squad level up. Yeah, I really deserved that. I'm sure you can tell, but I'm actually having a really difficult time taking out this purple team. They're just slaughtering us. It's like the Normandy beaches here. Look at that heavy machine gun turret. Even the shield guy can't survive, mate. Look at that. I just bought an entire squad and they're all dead. This is the most brutal part of this bridge battle I've seen so far. That was like a 12-man squad just immediately slaughtered. You know what? I just forgot. I've not even been using my ability. Look at this. Check this out. I can do this like roly ball thing. I'm not sure if it's gonna keep me alive. In fact, it looks like it's definitely not, although I'm definitely surviving. I survived way longer than I would have done without that roly ball thing. No, don't shoot me. We're trying to have a hammer off, bruh. Oh, look at that money box right there. Yes, please. All right, here we go. We're going for the roly ball strategy again. Let's go. What a dive that was, actually. Okay, that's the strategy. Look at that. I've just marched through into enemy territory and down I go. That's the strategy. Now all I've got to do is just not die to every other bot that's down here already. Mate, they are so... Oh, no. No, no, no. <laughs> okay, looks like we're getting a fairly big push. Okay, when you jump like that, you can throw yourself. Come on. There we go. There we go. Come on. Let's get this base. Let's get that base. Everyone on that. Everyone... No, they're about to spawn a big lad. Oh, 
Oh, no. They didn't just spawn that. That's some really unfortunate timing, if I'm honest. Yeah, I'm dead. Oh, did we just kill their big guy? We might have actually just killed their big guy. Yeah, I think my boys just hammered it to death. Let's go. Yes, the flame is also now mine. So now we make the final push on their base. Now, if I can take out their infrastructure back here, then hopefully I can just, like, basically destroy their gold supply. But destroy their gold... Oh, here we go. This laddie's taking all the... Oh, it's my own grenade. I didn't even see it. Okay, what just happened there? And their machine gun tower has been taken down already. They must only have a couple of... Yeah, okay, they got a bunch of armored stuff up here, but that is nothing that we can't deal with. No, 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 don't kill me, don't kill me. My guy's so upgraded. No. Okay, everyone on the big lad, everyone on that big thing right there. I cannot be bothered dealing with another one of those boys. So if you could just kill it like straight away, that would be excellent. Okay, there we go. That's what I'm talking about. If we could have just done that earlier, that would have been brilliant. But there we go, at least better late than never. I suppose. And the cavalry is here. Let's very quickly make an armored barracks out of that. And I actually, genuinely at this point, I've got to say, I was, I completely forgot this game was made by like Baron and like his team. I think he said it was like four people working with him or four people total. But the fact that Baron Von Games has made this game is actually genuinely really impressive. This is actually a lot of fun. And I look forward to seeing what they do with this game because it's got a lot of potential. Yeah, a multi. Oh my lord. That. Okay, I haven't seen one of those before. They look terrifying. And these lads are not messing around. This is like a traffic jam to get up here. Look at this. Okay. Oh, it's dead. It's dead. I think we killed it. Let's just squeeze through that. Get it killed. Come on, boys. Get on that. I'm not having any more of these respawning. Three, two, one percent victory. Let's go. Bot Wars first victory of the season. Game time. 47 minutes. Yeah, that'll probably be cut down for you guys. And then it takes takes us back to the home screen and we can see Win Chat with 11 kills was our top bot who is our employee of the month. Should you buy Bot Wars and is it worth it? Ultimately, if you like what you just watched, then the answer is yes. And that is for two main reasons. Firstly, it combines a lot of different characteristics into a game that I really enjoy and it has a very unique aesthetic. But secondly, if you're a fan of Baron and or his channel, then this is a brilliant way of supporting him. Him and his team have put nine long months into the development of this game. And so getting this game is a brilliant way of supporting not only Baron's channel, but his future aspirations with game development. And thus, the link to the Bot Wars Steam page will be in the top of the description. So go and add this to your wish list. And now for the Bot Wars giveaway. Senior Baron Von Games gave me a Steam key. But me, being the simp that I am, wanted to support the development of this game anyway. And so I will be gifting a Bot Wars Steam key to one of you. All you've got to do to enter is make sure you comment on this video, like the video, and make sure you're subscribed. I will then throw all of the names in a hat and pick one at random which I will announce on social media. Thank you very much for watching my Bot Wars gameplay. Thank you once again to Baron for the key and don't forget to check out the Steam link in the description below.